Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Alice. Today I'm going to show you how to make a seashell macrame keychain. It's very simple and suitable for beginner. Material needed are four strings of three mm size cord, measured at eighty cm each, and one lobster class keyring. First, fold the cord into half and loop in the center through the keyring. Then tie the cord to the keyring using reverse lug head knot for all the four strings. Next, let's make the pattern using diagonal double half each knot. Take the fourth cord on the right and cross to the left side. Then take the third cord on the right and loop it through the fourth cord and tighten it. Make another loop. Here is the first double half each knot. Continue the knot until you reach the last string on the right side. Now, repeat the same pattern on the left side. Repeat the same pattern for the second row. Left a little gap between the top row and the second row. I use my index finger as measurement here. Continue the knot in the same manner. Repeat another 3 row of the similar pattern on both sides. I make a total of 5 rows diagonal double half each knot on both sides. Now, Gather all the cord on both sides. Make any adjustment before tying the knot. Take one cord that is the longest and form an edge shape to create a loop. Then, take another one cord that is the longest as well and wrap around all the cord.
Here, I wrap around three times and then insert the cord into the loop I created earlier. Pull the loop cord downward while holding the cord that wrapping around all the cord tight. Pull the loop cord all the way through. Here you will see the cord that wrapping around all the cord earlier coming down as well. Pull that cord through. Cut the cord to your desired length. I cut the cord at 5cm length. To create the fringes, take a comb and comb the cord to loosen it. This step is optional. You can leave the cord just as it is after cut it to your desired length. There you have it. You can create as many colors as you like. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for more tutorial and video.